How do you guys? So, what have I got here? Right, this book is based on basically these. But it does have exceedingly good pictures in it. So it's a good reference book. So I can't remember what I paid for it. I don't know if it's written on the book. No. But it was, wasn't was the most expensive book I bought. It wasn't the cheapest, but it's a good book because <clears throat> what you get in it, I'm not going to show you page for page because it just takes forever. But basically, as you start, it was done by this guy, Michael Stephan. That's him there. Um, and you get pictures like that and so forth. It's not, it's kind of like a Duke Hawkins type book. Um, so you get some like really you know, nice pictures on the pages. Um, so like an, there's an engine change, there's the engine shed. I actually used to know, um, it was quite a while ago now, I've forgotten his name, but I used to know a bloke who used to work in there at Lake Heath. <coughs> and um, he sent some very interesting you know, pictures and videos of, of these jets being um, tested in the factory that's there. And it was quite something else. But there you go. Um, so like, there you go, you've got a picture of Liberty Bird and the cockpit and some nice pictures of it in McLoop and obviously landing on the runway somewhere. I don't know where that is, but there you go. It probably does tell you. But, but the, the good thing about it is they're all colour pictures <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> um, and they're not splitting off. It gets them on the pages. You know. I mean, it's um, you know, it's constant. I mean, that's the guy there who done a book, Michael Stephan himself. Um, but when you get out the back, you see you get the F fifteen Cs. They're all in there, and then it's the F thirty fives. Um, you know, it's just a it's just a, a really good book, the Farewell the F fifteen C. And oh but talk of the devil, he does split one picture there. I don't think there's many like that, but you know that there's one that I found. <laughs> Eat me words, Pratt. <laughs> but um yeah, I mean it's 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 a fantastic book. But up the back, when you go a bit further up, oh no, there's another one talking to the devil. You get this. So with the HH60 helicopter connect, uh, Kelly Hawk kit that I got yesterday, now I'm going to have to move this bag. It's making me sweat to hang. I don't really need it there <coughs> for the time being. Um, yeah, you get some nice pictures of these, um, you know, pay forks um, lurking around. Unfortunately, it's not a modelling book, but that's the only copy picture you get. But just as a general, you know, look around thing. You know, I mean, yeah, what they do and the history of them. You know, it's actually quite, and there's the F-35 right at the very rear. But yeah, it's, um, yeah, you get some nice pictures of them and you can see what the the things do and read about them. And then you got to the, the end there, and there's the old uh, Valkyrie Squadron. And then there's all the Duke Hawkins books that, uh, that there are available. There's probably a... May have been one or two more added to that collection since this went out. And there you go. And then that's the back there. Um, it's a matte cover. Uh, but glossy pages. There you go. Look, Jill Hawkins presents Michael Stephan's Eagles Rock, the 48th Fighter Wing, where combat air power lives. Been a long time since I've been up there. But my main thing was about the, the, piece, the piece in the back with the, the halos, but um, what a book. It's, it's, a, it's an amazing book. It's really nice, good color pictures, like I say, and a bit of history as well. So there you go. <clears throat> so um, yeah, if you, want a, if you want a copy of this, um, the Aviation Bookshop in Tunbridge Wells, um, that's where I got this from. Um, I think it's, if you want one for Christmas, go onto their website, the Aviation Bookshop, type that in, 
in Google and it will come up with their website, Tunbridge Wells. They go on their website, they have deals. So sometimes you'll get this for next to nothing in their shop on if they've got it on the Christmas special they have discounts and you know 25% off something like that um buy one get one free sort of thing so you know you buy a book you might be able to get that one free you never know that's if they got them I don't know it's been out a while now but I thought when I got that helicopter <clears throat> I thought just show you that this is one of the, the references you can use for helicopters in action um there is another book out I haven't got it I'm gonna to have to have a look for it to see how where I get it from, where's the cheapest place, because Amazon are doing a bit of prime dealing at the moment. Um but it's um it's an American book. It's um, it's oh god, what's it's a bit like the WWP books. Um so you get lots of glossy pictures. The book's not quite as big as this, probably a little bit smaller. Um but it, again, they're, they're expensive books. I mean, the last one was the MH53 or the CH53, whatever they want to call them now. Um, I think that was nearly 60 quid. And it's only a little flimsy book. It's got quite a bit in it, you know, in the pictures. But some of the pictures are like tiny, the size of a little matchbox or Swan, Swan Vista matchbox. They go and go back some years now if they don't, if they don't still make them. But, um, yeah, but this, this book is, if you like F15s, it's an amazing book. Um, but there's a bit in the back to do with the kitty hawk that I uh, took a look at yesterday. So, without further ado, I'll let you get on with your day, uh, enjoy life, and we'll see you in the next one.